Okay, I've been seeing these videos all over my YouTube algorithm. Waking up at 5 a.m. Wake up at 5 a.m. At 5 a.m. At 5 a.m. And it had me wondering, why is everyone waking up at 5 a.m. and should I do it too? So I hopped onto my laptop and did a deep internet search into the benefits of waking up at 5 a.m. And I can see why people wake up at 5 a.m. Studies claim that waking up at 5 a.m. increases productivity and motivation, promotes healthy sleep patterns, improves mental health, gives us more time to do the things we love, and so many more benefits. And as a person who is constantly trying to find new ways to better myself and evolve my everyday routine, I have to test and see for myself if waking up at 5 a.m. is going to change my life. Before we continue on the video, I do want to quickly discuss the flip side of waking up at 5 a.m. All of this talk about waking up at 5 a.m may be promoting that burnout culture that our society is so obsessed with. You may think that, oh, if I'm not waking up at 5 a.m., then I'm wasting my time and I'm falling behind. And I'm here to tell you that that is not what it means at all. And please understand that waking up at 5 a.m. is just a means to an end. It's not the actual end itself. This goes to say that waking up at 5 a.m. does not guarantee you success and it does not guarantee that all of your aspirations are set to be accomplished. Needless to say, I'm going to try waking up at 5 a.m. for a week because I love my mornings and I'm just very curious to see how waking up one to two hours earlier than the time that I usually wake up is really going to change anything. I'm heading to this week with the intention to learn as many things as I possibly can, but with no expectations of how it will turn out. This way, I'm opening up my space to any new opportunities and unexpected possibilities that may arise. All right, guys, let's do it. Oh my God, it's early. 5.03 right now. God, my body is so confused right now. What is going on? Ugh. It's so dark outside, oh my gosh. Guys, I am wide awake right now. I feel great. I just did my morning routine and I'm about to work out. It was just that little moment of regret when I was getting out of bed. But once I got up and changed and all that, I feel amazing. my time this morning not in a rush just chilling and it's only 7:30, and i i did already so many things one thing though it's important to not get carried away with doing things too slowly like that kind of defeats the whole purpose of waking up at 5 a.m if you're going to take now let's say four hours to do the same thing that you can do in like one hour but other than that i think i'm pretty good with this I've, i did a lot today and i'm very happy You guys, it's 10.30 a.m. and I finished a video, I'm making the thumbnail, I'm uploading, I have my matcha, lavender matcha, and I feel so good. Oh my gosh, I should be waking up at 5 every single day. I'm excited to wake up tomorrow. First day, pretty good. Let's see what happens tomorrow. Oh, last night, I could not fall asleep. I think it was that matcha. I could barely wake up this morning. But I'm awake, it's five. It's time to start the day. I'm up. All right, let's get this day started. What should I wear today to work out? I guess I'll wear this. These are always comfy to wear. I'm waiting for the morning that this gets easier. Okay, I just finished a Pilates session with Moo with Nicole. I love her. She is such a beautiful soul. That rhymed, kind of. But right now, I'm going to meditate for a few minutes, then do some stretches before I carry on with the day. Hello, guys. I have some blueberries here. And I'm about to record something, so that's why I have this mic here. You want some? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Every day I'm shuffling. 
50. The newest My Media Memoir is coming out today. I'm excited. If you haven't yet, go check it out. You don't want to miss out because I give you guys the best details about living my best single life. <laughs> I do everything by myself and I love it. Like, I never get bored of me. I love being with me. Let's see if this avocado is cute. If it's not, we're throwing her away. Oh no, it's kind of hard. Don't do this to me. Don't do this. Oh, ew. I'm still gonna eat it though. Here's one thing I've noticed about waking up early, even though this is only my second day. I've noticed that my mood is so much better. I mean, in general, I, I'm always in a pretty decently good mood, but just like waking up early puts me on another level. I feel like I'm on a dopamine high the whole time. I don't know what it is. I think just like waking up early gives me more time to do things that I need to do in a day. I mean, obviously, um, but it also just gives me more time to myself. It's only been two days, but I'm already seeing the effects of waking up at 5 a.m. and I can see why people do it. I can see why. Look at this big baby. <laughs> Guys, I just came back from the office and I am absolutely pooped. Well, anywho, while I was driving back, I was really craving a bill bar or something. And when I came home, I got this new package from them. Let me just show you. Dun, 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 dun. You have no idea how excited I was when I got this because something inside is a new goodie that they have launched. I'm gonna taste it with you guys my first time we have some protein balls we have the coconut almond flavor and the peanut butter brownie flavor they are gluten free grain free and dairy free oh that's nice 10 grams of protein 10 grams of protein for both bam oh my god i'm so excited Raw. Maybe. It looks like this. Let's give it a go. <sighs> it's so good. Whoa. I really like the texture of it. Mmm. It's inside. What is in there? Do you guys see that? Is that almond butter? <gasps> oh my god. It has almond butter filling. I love almond butter. All right. Let's try peanut butter brownie. Mmm. Oh, this one has peanut butter filling. I see it. <gasps> Look at that. So in many emotions running through my mind right now. I like how they calculate the servings. Two is absolutely perfect. I feel so good right now. Oh my God. I want to eat more, but I'm really full right now because I just had lunch and I had some fruits. And I also had two protein balls. Yeah, go check them out, you guys. I'll link everything down below. Use each 10 at the checkout to get discount off. And see you guys tomorrow. Guys, I've done goof. Wow, my hair is not cute right now, but do I care? No, not really. It's 6 a.m. and I, I woke up a little late. But hear me out. I woke up at 5. I did wake up. My bed was so comfortable that I just could not get up. And I was like, okay, five more minutes. And five more minutes turned into an hour. It is what it is. So, gonna make the most out of it, but at least I feel good. I still cannot believe I didn't wake up. Darn it, but it's okay, it happens. But anywho, we lost an hour, but technically we, we didn't because today I'm having a rest day, my body's a little sore. Right now I'm debating if I wanna make a matcha latte or get some coffee. And I know I cannot have both because if I have both, I will actually not be okay. I changed. We're gonna go get coffee. So guys, I've arrived at the coffee shop i brought mochi with me i'm gonna leave him here with you guys please watch him for me you be a good boy okay they're gonna watch you for me okay okay make sure you say thank you okay i'm back Alrighty, let's go home to mommy Why do I keep indulging in unhealthy behavior?
That was a really good journaling session. Very good, very good. I'm going to... I don't know what I'm going to do right now. I think I need to help my mom or something. So I'm going to do that. And then I have work. So yeah. <laughs> good morning. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. Today, it's very easy to wake up at five. I don't know why. I am going to go for a run. I'm very excited. I haven't ran in so long. I used to run every single day. I don't know how my stamina is going to be, but I'm excited to run again. I love running. I love cardio. It's just like, I'm a cardio bitch. Let's get today started. Ugh. Hello, everyone. It's me, Liz. Welcome to another video. Hello babes, I'm going on a morning run right now. Just finished editing the lower ab workout. Uploading right now. But yeah, I'm going on a run. I'm wearing this like top from Jim Shockey and my leggings from Lulu Lemon. <laughs> Lulu Lemon. You like emoji the this emoji? Everyone's been using this emoji and I think it's just so funny. I hope you guys know what I'm talking about or else I'm gonna sound crazy. Avocado pudding. 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 Something like mom. She would say, Kava Auto. I'm like, no, mommy, it's avocado. I'm gonna draw free shavaka do. Free shavaka! You sure? I'm gonna draw a free shavaka. I'm gonna draw a Good morning. I look crazy, but I'm awake now. Refreshed, and I'm gonna go on a morning run. Okay, ever since I started to wake up at 5 a.m. and to film this video for you guys, I've noticed that everything in my life has lifted to another level in a good way. I have this overarching intention to make the most out of every single second. And because I am doing that and I have these intentions, I've been very selective with how I spend my time. Every single moment, every choice I make, I really think about it and I really have a little moment and think to myself like, oh, is this what I need to do right now? Back from the run, now let's make some oatmeal. I'm mixing some Greek yogurt with my oatmeal right now. I learned this from my friend Sammy. She did it with overnight oats, but I'm just gonna do it with, with hot oatmeal. Putting it into the fridge for it to chill for a while. I'm gonna take a shower and we're gonna come back to this. Mm, wow. Good morning, you guys. It's, this lighting is not good. It's 5.16 right now, and I'm about to head to the gym. I haven't been to the gym in a really long time, so this is kind of like my first time back in a hot minute. I've been wearing this top a little too much this week, but that's okay. I had such a great workout. I'm shaking. I'm gonna put my AirPods away because that's rude if I talk to you guys with my AirPods on. I'm gonna head home, take a nice hot shower. Actually, a cold shower because it's too hot for hot. <laughs> I can't say it right now. After I make a yummy breakfast that I have in mind, I saw it somewhere and it's exciting. It has to do with pancakes. Ha ha ha. But not just any pancakes. Yummy green pancakes. 
pancakes. Green eggs and green ham. Wait, is that, is that the book? I don't remember. All right, JK guys, I lied. I'm going to make breakfast first because I'm starving. So what I'm about to make here is a spinach pancake-y. Ooh, so we need eggs, oats, spinachi, of course, and banana. I'm going to put it all in this little blendy blend blend. First up, the banana. And I saw the person use a whole lot of oats. So I'm just gonna put like a little bit less than a cup because I feel like a cup is a lot. Like, whoa. Cracking the eggs. Let's see if I can do it with one hand. I've done this before. Bam. Oh my god, my battery's dying. <laughs> I got change. I'm gonna have to show on the side. I wanna see how long it actually takes for it to die because it's right now it's like flashing red. So let's just wait. I dare you to die on me. I dare you. After a week of waking up by 5 a.m., here's what I have to say. This week is one of the best weeks I've had so far in 2021. Starting with the obvious, my productivity level skyrocketed through the roof, and I had an uncontainable amount of energy throughout the whole day, every day. I had more time to do what I needed to accomplish in a day, and also had the time to wind down and relax, like watching a movie. My mood was elevated to a higher level, and I was somehow more grounded than I've ever been before. I said at the beginning of this video that I did not have any expectations set for this week. So when I came to the realization of my newfound sense of clarity and inner balance, I instantly knew it was a result of waking up at 5 a.m. And this week wasn't just about waking up at a certain time to hop on a certain trend. The whole purpose of it all is to live in a cogent time frame to do the things that make me happy and fulfilled. This week is about trying the unknown in hopes of finding a new way of living that enhances every area and aspect of my life. I noticed that I've been seeking more ways to take care of myself. For instance, I picked up chess again, I drew a warm bath, I had a slow meditative morning, and I had time to fully relax. I know I can still do all these things without having to wake up at 5 a.m., but because I subconsciously knew that I had more time, I did these things without feeling rushed, without feeling guilty. It was as if I were living in a balanced bubble of completeness for an entire week. I had exactly what I needed, and that was time in me. Opening up my time to waiting possibilities opened my life to a new realm of self-care and self-love. I experienced self-discipline on an inflated level, and I ultimately understood that taking care of myself is more important than anything else. Waking up at 5 doesn't give me more time to finish my to-do list. It gives me more time to be with myself and to appreciate that very thing that time is, life. So it really doesn't matter what time we wake up. What matters is how we treat ourselves and how we treat the precious chances that time has to offer. Alright, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye bye!